Hi guys, Steve here. So I was playing Icarus and I was really enjoying it. It's got all the elements of a good survival game, apart from taming. I just finished the first map, then I found out a game mechanic that I really hate. So much so, I don't know if I'm going to carry on playing. It defies logic and common sense and completely breaks immersion. The first map teaches you the basics and then the main mission goal is to build a shelter. So I spent the night building a lovely looking home. I knew from chat that when I finished that map and go back to the spaceship, that everything I built would be wiped, so I just built for XP. I thought you finish the map, go up to the ship, then start a new map. Okay, it's annoying and disappointing that I can't go back to my nice house I built, but if it's a new area, I get it. The thing is though, the next mission map, and the main problem I have with the game, is that you land in the same place on the exact same map again. You've just got new missions, but everything has been wiped off the map, and it's been reset. So you're not starting in a new map or area, it's the same one you've just finished, and they've just wiped your house and everything you've collected for nothing. Why? If we've got new missions on the same map in the exact same area, why do you have to wipe the map clean so we lose all our stuff and waste our time? So we have to collect all the resources again, craft all the items and build our house again. For no reason. When every other game in existence, you would just carry on with your missions. You could have just simply dropped a mission crate in and gave us the items we need to continue. Chat told me you'd be playing on the same map about four times before you move to the new zone. Restart again with nothing each time. Build up, lose everything, build up, lose everything, build up, lose everything, etc. It's disappointing, demoralising that you've got to waste your time starting over each time. Defies logic, because why on earth would you want to do that to people? There's a point of survival games is progression, and you're just wiping it for no reason each time. The only two reasons I can think of to do this is to artificially prolong how long we play the game for by making us start over again each time with nothing. To just keep us in the game longer by making us repeat the same thing. Or second, that the devs couldn't work out how to progress to the next lot of missions. I.e. they didn't know how to add the new items or missions onto the map and let you continue. So they broke each part into separate segments, starting on a refreshed map each time. But the problem with doing this is that it completely breaks any immersion. We're supposed to be astronauts coming down from a space station to build up and survive on a planet. But every time we go back up to the space station and come down to the same plot of land we just left, everything's wiped and been reset. So it's not in any way real and feels more like a fake simulation. And Ark's already done the plane in a simulation thing to death. So it makes us feel like none of the stuff we're actually doing is real. It's demoralising losing your bases that you put a lot of thought and love into. And it'll get really irritating starting over from scratch each time. It's like getting your base wiped in Ark every single day and losing everything. Apart from your XP and your blueprints you've learnt. But instead of players wiping you, the game does for no reason just because you finished your missions. That mechanic there is enough for people to quit the game or not buy it. I enjoy playing it, but knowing everything you collect and build each mission is going to be wiped is a huge gigantic hurdle to get over because I don't like wasting my time. This mechanic forces us not to make nice bases because it's a waste of time and instead you might as well just make a square box just to protect your stuff with no creativity or imagination at all. From chat I know later on you can build in outposts, which I think are areas that can save a building, and you get two extra outposts if you buy the most expensive version of the game, which is a bit pay to win, but you don't experience outposts until later on, and by the time people with foresight finish the first mission to see what the game mechanic says, that's when they'll quit playing because I know we have to start again with nothing each time, so they'll never even get to outposts. Anyway, what do you guys think of this mechanic? Let me know in the comments below. I think we should scrap splitting the same map into different missions where it refreshes every time and have it so if you're on a map and you've built a base you complete your missions then you just carry on and get the next lot of missions like every other game in existence i don't know why the devs did it this way as it's not logical i don't know why anyone in beta didn't pick this up and tell them but the game's out now so it's probably too late to change anyway well i hope this video has been informative and if it has please like and subscribe let me know if you think I should continue playing. Goodbye.